Hey everyone, so where I'm staying kind of has an ant problem. Um, it's very clean and like there's not really food lying around or anything. So I don't know. I swear it's like built on top of an ant mound. I don't know. Anyways, just I'm always seeing like ants here and there and it's just horrible and I want to get rid of them. So anyway, someone suggested this to me. Um, this is called the Eliminator Ultrasonic Pest Repellers. It is supposed to get rid of all kinds of pests. And as you can see, I got the six pack. These are the two smaller ones, a little bit larger. These are the largest. And then these two have um, outlets attached. You can see it says these ones are for the kitchen and bathroom. These ones here, the middle size, the smaller ones are for kitchen bathroom. The middle size is halls basements and attic and then the biggest ones are bedrooms and family rooms um, emits ultrasound waves to repel rodents it's obviously pests too I don't know why they don't say pests there um, variable frequency indoor use only so I actually just want to make this video and show you what these are and um, in this same video here I'll let you know after a while if they actually work uh, let's see if there's any other information on the back. Nope, that's pretty much it. Money back guarantee. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and plug these in. Let me show you. All right, guys, and here's just an up-close look. This is the biggest one. And again, they say that one. This one is for bedrooms and family rooms. Here is the middle one up front. This one does not have a plug on it. But that one is for halls and basements and is... And then this is the little one up close. So you plug it in and the red light comes on. Let's go ahead and plug it in. Okay, so I'm plugging this one in the room we are in the most. You can see the red light came on. And you know, it does go in a certain way. I, I had to put it in upside down, you see? because that is obviously a little bit bigger than the other one and the way this plug is I had to put it upside down but no big deal okay so I plugged it in there I'm gonna plug the rest in and I will be back in a few days again on the same video and let you know what I think the results are guys something else I want to just show some of the instructions because I do think this is important I'm one to not usually read instructions but this says your Eliminator ultrasonic pest repeller works with a standard 120 volt wall outlet. Simply plug it in and the LED red light comes on to let you know it is working. It emits high frequency ultrasonic sound waves that help repel rodents. Varying ultrasonic waves, sound waves, uh, prevent rodents from getting used to the pest repeller sound. Ultrasonic sounds cannot penetrate walls, cabinets, or furniture. Therefore, multiple units are needed for multiple rooms. Indoor use only. Sorry with the way I read that. I'm reading it through like the phone screen, so it's a little hard to see. Um, let's see, important safety instructions. This product helps repel rodents. Therefore, do not use around rodents, rodent pets, such as mice, hamsters, gerbils, guinea pigs, and rabbits. Even though we don't have any of those things, that's good for somebody to know that does. Um, place the unit where it can get proper ventilation and do not block ventilation openings on the unit. Do not place the unit near water to clean. Just unplug the unit. Use a damp cloth to wipe off the dirt. Connect the unit directly into the power source. Do not use extension cords. For the large model unit with extra outlet, do not use extension cords. Uh, to avoid risk of electrical shock or fire, do not open the unit and keep these instructions for reference. Um, also, guys, I just plugged it in. I know I said it was going to come back in a couple days and I will, but I was also reading a little bit on it and it said that at first you may notice an increase in pests and or rodents because they're getting out of their normal hiding places and after a few weeks is whenever you'll actually notice it so i'll come back in a couple days and let you know and then i'll also come back in a few weeks and let you know okay guys so it's been two days i know this is literally just one ant but there are still a few ants that i see so i'm going to come back in about two weeks all right, guys, so that previous clip, I know you just seen one ant, <laughs> but just full disclosure. So, you know, I mop the floor, I sweep and everything, but here's an example. Let's say my toddler dropped a chunk of food on the floor, and then when I would come back, there would be a million ants. So it's not like I seen a million ants all the time, but like I, I would come back from the store and there would be like a hundred ants on like one little piece of food. And it was like crazy, like well, I don't know where they were all hiding. 
So anyways, that was at the two day mark. So now it's been about two weeks and I have to say there has been a dramatic decrease in the amount of ants. I do still see one here and there. Um, and you know, at the beginning I seen one here and there, but uh, like I said, when I would come back and there would be a million ants on the chunk of food, my toddler, that still happens, there would be a chunk of food and I'll maybe see like one or two ants. So that's full disclosure. I really do think these are working because where else would they be, right? <laughs> because that had been going on for a really long time. I mean, I was like, oh, maybe I'm not mopping the floor enough. So, you know, I would make sure I did it every day instead of every other day. Thank you. Um, so anyways, I give these a thumbs up. I got six of them for under $20. I think it was a good deal. I mean, it's, it, what else can it be doing? It's not hurting anything. So, you know, at the very least, I know it's at least helping to eliminate ants and like it said rodents and pests and all that so thumbs up for these thank you for watching please like comment share and subscribe